girl. I do chemistry like a girl. I rock my like a girl. I play sand volleyball like a girl. I fight like a girl. I calculate like a girl. Play like a girl. Play tennis like a girl. Win like a girl. I shoot like a girl. Yeah, Hillary Knight does shoot like a girl, and uh, that shot, I can tell you, is pretty hard. You are the one of the most accomplished Olympic hockey players from the United States. Uh, and, and talk about a shot, too. You just blocked a shot most recently in one of your games, and, and what happened? I did. I actually broke my foot about six weeks ago. Isn't that amazing? Like, girls can hit hard, they can play hard, they're smart. And that's really the focus of this campaign. Absolutely. Um, that's why I got involved with the Always Like a Girl campaign. It was something that it empowers women worldwide and really pulled on my heartstrings there because like shooting like a girl is something that I do. And um, being able to have that positive image with a shot, shooting like a girl is important. So I blocked a shot like a girl and I actually <laughs> broke my foot because the, the woman behind the shot was extremely powerful. So And like a girl, you're going to continue to play in the Carcassonne Cup, which uh, so just a few weeks ago would break your foot, but that doesn't matter. No, no, it's do or die. It's playoff hockey. And how, how, how does it look like you guys are going to make out? Well, we're in the championship game tomorrow at 2 p.m. Uh, over in Markham, so I hope, I hope we do well. Yeah, talk to me about your career. Did you, did you face any adversity going through in, in a male-dominated sport? Absolutely. I think uh, I was just on the cusp of almost having girls and boys hockey, but I uh, was growing up with mostly boys. And just playing hockey and having, you know, the other teams kind of bully me a little bit because I was a girl really empowered me and gave me the confidence to continue and really push through things and just want to be the best hockey player when I hopped on the ice. Yeah, studies show as, as females get a little bit older in age, they lose confidence and compared to their male counterparts. Uh, you're here today to say be confident, be strong, and to continue to push forward. Absolutely. I had a very powerful female figure in my life, which was my mother, and fortunately for me, she was the one who really gave me the confidence to continue to go and really empowered me and said, it's okay, you know, you're a girl, but you're going to do things like a girl. And that was a powerful message. I wasn't dismayed or deterred from my goal of being on an Olympic team or playing hockey in its own respect, but I'm fortunate that she was that powerful figure in my life. Yeah, a couple silver medals that you <laughs> yeah. have. That's pretty good. Yeah. And so now you want people to spread this message. And how did they do that? Um, actually, I would love people to participate on social media, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. If you use the hashtag like a girl, um, check out the like a girl stronger together video on YouTube and just participate. It's, it's great what we can do and continue this movement. And if you have some time, cheer for you and Markham this weekend. Absolutely. The Boston <laughs> Blades will be taking on uh, the Montreal Stars tomorrow. And what do you think the prediction is? How, how badly are you going to beat them? <laughs> I hope pretty badly. <laughs> <laughs> like a girl, of course. She's going to beat them badly. Once again, Hillary Knight, thank you for joining us. For more information, go to breakfasttelevision.com. And also, a reminder, on Twitter, all the social media, the hashtag, once again, is hashtag... Like a girl. You got it. We're going to take a break right now from Breakfast Television. Hillary, thank you for coming thank in this so morning. Much. Good luck tomorrow as well. Thank you. You don't need luck. <laughs>